So our last race from Chepstow in the mud is the Welsh Hurdle. up. It's a Grade 2 event. As we wait for the runners to come up. It's over two miles and five furlongs. So Raging Thunder for Joshua Sutherland. Fox in the box for Pedro Hogan. Cat Iron for Leon Van Rensburg. National Guard for Daniel French. First time out along with Senchi Reform for Vinnie Gerard. Jehan Bucks Jolly for Prey Greg Hogan. Dodgy Mistress for Pontypool Racing. David Robertson's Light Together. Long Beach for David Hooley. Indian Queens for Darren Thompson. Mazuna Judith for Alex Cherry. And Big Penny for Craig Beckwith makes up the 12th. To go over two miles and five furlongs here in the mud. Over the hurdle course. Flags raised and they're racing. Again, they've started on the turn here at Chepstow. Raging thunder of Joshua Southern is Dennis the Menace Silks. It's going to lead them to the first of the 12 flights. From the remaining, rather, the remainder, all doing well together. Go throw a blanket over them. So they go over the first. Pecked a little bit on landing, was cat iron towards the rear there. Hold is Fox in the box. The yellow silks black cap as they go over the second. I'll clear that this time it was Maxuna or Mazuna Judith. For Alex Jerry towards the rear that didn't get over it particularly well. Very unlucky in the Welsh Grand National in the previous race. They will skip over the third. Again, Mazuna Judith was a little bit slow. So Raging Thunder leads from Indian Indian Queens. National Guard up against the Rowl and Fox in the box and Dodgy Mistress and Big Penny. They're followed through by Senchi Reform and Johan Bucks Jolly, Long Beach, Cat Iron, just right at the rear. It's Mazuna Judith. As we come past the grandstand. It's the winning post. We'll have a full circuit to go. Clutterbuck. I agree, mate. I can't believe I've won those maidens, but let's be honest, those flat maidens were pretty weak. So don't go messing around too much with my ratings. Probably just beginner's luck. Anyway, back to the Welsh hurdle. Getting my mention in for the flat handicapper. But anyway, Raging Thunder leads this one from National Garden Indian Queens. Then we've got Fox in the Box and Light together. Dodgy Mistress in between Senchi Reform and Jehan Bucks Jolly. The outside of that one is Craig, Craig Beckwith's Big Penny. Good jump there by Cat Iron. We've got a bit of room along the racing route. And we've got Long Beach. Let's go over the six, so half of the hurdle's dump. Azuna Judith still just off the pace a little bit of the rear. Get to the seventh. He clears that. So Raging Thunder still our leader. So we'll start the home turn. It's a great two event. The one that's moved up and improved considerably is Cat Iron for Leon Van Rensburg. Just take a little hold now as you come into the eight, steadied off of it. And one over that slow jump at the rear again by Mazuna Judith. But Raging Thunder still leads us. With just less than a mile to run. Cat Iron in Indian Queens. Dodgy Mistress. Middle of the course. Up against the Rowers National Guard. Jahan Bucks Jolly is there. And then Big Penny widest of all. Inside of that is Senchi Reform. Making a little bit of a move now. Trying to improve. Off the bridle. And it's Raging Thunder. As they come off this turn. And they'll straighten up with five furlongs to run three hurdles to take. So Raging Thunder been there since the beginning from Cat Iron and Indian Queens. Dodgy Mistress, Johanna Bucks, Jolly, Senchi Reform moving well wide outside now is Light Tiger and Fox in the box but with four and a half furlongs to go as they come to the ninth which is three from home and it's Raging Thunder from Indian Queens and Cat Iron. He's over it well but a little bit slower. Indian Queens jumped it well. Out wide is Light Tiger but it's still this Raging Thunder. Raging Thunder from Indian Queens, Light Together 
Cruising through the pack is Long Beach, but it's this raging thunder in the mud. Hard to catch with three furlongs left to go and just two to jump. It's raging thunder from Century Reform that moves into second. National Guard trying to get up on the wide outside off the rail now in third, but it's raging thunder. Still holds the lead, but here come National Guard, Century Reform and Cat Iron. Running well also is Indian Queens on the wide outside is Big Penny. And then up front it's all changes. National Guard takes it up from Cat Iron. They go over it together. Cat Iron gets away from it better. We're inside the final furlong and it's Cat Iron from National Guard, Indian Queens, Raging Thunders going further and further back our long time leader. So it's a win. The Welsh Hurdle Grade 2 event. Cat Iron takes it for Josh Sutherland. National Guard was second. Indian Queens was third. Big Penny, big race at the end there, got up for fourth. So our Grade 2 event. Comfortable win in the end for Cat Iron from National Guard in second. Indian Queen's got it for third. I'm not sure of National Guard. Is that Daniel French? I'll have a quick look. I'm not sure of the silks there. It was Daniel French. Well done for a second there, mate. Cat Iron for Leon Remnants who takes it. Indian Queen's for Darren Thompson was third. Big Penny for Craig Beckwith got up for fourth. And Long Beach for David Hooley was fifth.